Hi everyone, it's time for us to take a look at the Global Financial Markets Outlook 2nd quarter 2024. It is a quite eventful quarter one. Eight topics for discussion today. The eighth topic, insight from Q1 successful trading experience, why trading AI, semiconductors, crypto proxy, and why not trading AIA shares. The first topic to discuss, 12% trading return was generated by following Q1 tactics. Global stock market performances in Q1, Q2 US interest rate outlook, AI plays, alternative financial assets, crypto, energy, gold, our takeaway for Q2 2024. Our personal asset allocation, trading rationale on key themes. Topic 1. Q1 trading performance. 12% realized absolute return on capital employed during Q1 2024. The pilot training program has registered over 12% absolute return in Q1 2024. The program is aiming to enhance overall portfolio yield, judging from the favorable liquidity conditions in equity markets. The trading tactics followed closely those themes mentioned in Q1 2024 outlook, i.e. AI theme we generate around 50 percent return generated by following closely the AI thematic trading stocks, energy around 8 percent, crypto proxy 67 percent, semiconductor around 7 percent. Abandon liquidity pour into several hot themes while investors are willing to take big bets. Topic 2. Q1 Global Stock Markets Performances US and Japan registered around 10% gain in US dollar terms, and China, Hong Kong, and Australia were performed slightly negative. Obviously, decent good returns for index ETF holders. This performance data shown in the above table strongly suggested 1. Risk-taking liquidity have been back to stock markets and they prefer US and US ally markets. Even with imminent currency devaluations concerns, for example on Japanese yen and US dollar. Second point. New generated liquidity from time deposits are seeking better than savings deposits returns. We still have the outlook for 2024. We expect no collapse in US and Japan stock markets, especially in Q2 2024. Yet, collection may come. B. Expect no teens positive returns in local currency terms for Asia stock markets during 2024. Topic 3. Range Trading It is for US interest rate outlook. Range fluctuation is expected for US 10-year Treasury rate at this moment, we do not have a great surge in interest rate, nor a large decline in interest rate, and we expect it to be continued in the coming quarter. Topic 4. AI thematic plays. 
We are exactly right in Q1 and proven by our trading returns. Expect mild consolidations in Q2 before these AI counters proven themselves again. May see buying opportunities emerge during Q2. AI will be the essential way to gain back economic competitiveness for US. It means investment opportunities. We have no change in our view. Topic 5. Alternatives, financial assets, crypto, gold, and commodities. You can see the Bitcoin register a 58.55% return in Q1, and crude oil also gained 13.97%. Gold, still positive, 3.63%. We expect these prices of these alternatives will remain buoyant in coming quarter. It is a good diversification play and investor put real money into it. Topic 6. Our 5 ticks for Q2 2024. U.S. interest rates, 10-year Treasury rate, will be fluctuated at a range of 4.5% to around 3.5% in coming quarter. We see crude oil price and U.S. CPI may go higher in Q2 2024. With domestic buying of U.S. government debt and replacing foreign buying, U.S. exchange rate will not be too strong against other major currencies as in 2023. May give more upside for gold, crypto, and other non-U.S. dollar currencies. Global equities markets will be supported by the current interest rate and local liquidity. U.S. equities market will continue to benefit from lesser U.S. capital outflow. Global push for sophisticated technology application, such as AI, will continue aiming to gain economic competitiveness. And we see these moves will provide monetization or investment opportunities. Need to aware to the very strong flush of liquidity into commonplace and causing short to medium term corrections. The depth and duration of correction will depend on the extent of over bullishness reflected by the market prices appreciation versus fundamental improvements. Topic 7 Personal Asset Allocation Q2 2024. For fixed deposit and high grade bonds, we put around 70% of the asset into it. It represents an increase of 5% from previous quarter. While cash for bottom fishing or for opportunities have been reduced to 5% from 10%. While risk asset with yield, we maintain at 1.5 15%, and risk asset without yield, we also retain around 10%. As we see, there are more favorable liquidity conditions in Q2 2024. So we have turned 10% of this risk asset allocation into a trading mode. It means it can be have a shorter investment horizon. The aim is to enhance overall portfolio yield in current financial year. Topic 8. We would like to share our insight through our 12% absolute return generated 
doing Q1 2024. Our traders felt abandoned liquidity are circulating around the AI thematic counters and semiconductor stocks and lesser in the ETF. We selected strong fundamental shares like the media, AMD, ASML, Meta, and Crypto Proxy MicroStrategy and top positions. This counter's market price were running very fast, and our trader inclined locking profit for first half of 2024. Reminding ourselves, trading programs are for enhancing the overall portfolio yield rather than long-term capital appreciation. We trade many life instead of AIA in Hong Kong stock market simply because of many life outperformed AIA in the last five years over 70% total returns. So if we fail this short-term trade on the insurance sector, we still own a strong performer in the sector. So we are in a win-win situation. Our Q2 trading thoughts. We expect trading liquidity will still be abandoned and focus on common thematic sectors such as AI and semiconductors, while energy, alternative energy, crypto, and commodities will be gaining more popularity during Q2 2024. We expect high frequency trading activities will be further enhanced due to intra-quarter corrections. It means higher volatilities and higher risk for most investors. We also expect more trading liquidities will go to the underperforming China slash Hong Kong markets for short to medium operations and search for trading opportunities. Investors need to mind the overall risk-taking capital employed, and the risk tolerance on potential realized losses. Wish you good luck in your investment journey. Always keep learning and keep yourself active. Moving innovative education enterprise, the real stuff. Wish you all the best in Q2 2024.